Hi everyone. Hi everyone. Hi everyone. My name is Gabby. I'm Naomi. I'm a junior. My name is Kate Rocco and I am a junior. I'm a junior. And today we're going to be showing you some tips and tricks on how to be successful in online learning. Firstly, we have organization. Stay organized. <laughs> Uh, being organized has many benefits, some of which include boosting your energy, reducing stress, and making you overall happier. Some tips for this. One, it's helpful to keep all of your classwork separate just like you would during in-person school. Separate folders, separate binders, etc. Having all your necessary materials at your fingertips can be helpful. You can organize them in your desk space or wherever it is that you do your schoolwork. Also, another idea is to use a planner to write down all of your class assignments, Zooms, and deadlines to help you stay on track. Next, we have creating a regular study space, free of distractions to use every day. It is helpful to have a desk or a table to work on opposed to a bed where you can get really lazy and fall asleep. I know I do that. It's good to have good lighting, and access to a computer. The space will act as your classroom and hopefully get you into a routine. Which leads us to our next point, establishing a daily routine. By creating a daily routine, you can wake up each morning with motivation and energy. Some things you can do to start a daily routine would be eat three meals a day, go outside for at least 30 minutes or more, take breaks for your mental health, and make sure to interact with your friends. Our last tip for helping you succeed in online learning is focusing on self-care. Taking care of yourself both mentally and physically should be your number one priority during this time. It is important to take breaks and ask yourself how you are doing, and also remember to check up on your loved ones who might be having a hard time as well. If you need someone to talk to, East Mountain has some really great resources. All of them are listed in the Timberwolf Times, the Weekly Wire, the East Mountain website, and the description box below. We hope these tips help you through these tough times. And we urge you to try them out. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time. And we'll see you next time. We'll see you next time.